Hey guys, uh, I'm Croyle, and as you can see from the title, I joined uh, Vivify as a Rainbow Six Siege content creator. Uh, I'm really happy to be a part of the org, and I'm really excited to bring you guys content. Um, so, as I've just joined the org, I thought it would be a good idea to ask people on Twitter to drop some questions about stuff they were wondering, just so you guys can get like an idea of who I am and uh, what I'm about, so let's get on with it. So, the first question asks... How long did it take you to get your current gun skill? Um, I've played Siege since Year 4 Season 1, so I am a bit of a newcomer to the game. But I say uh, only recently have I really stepped up my gun skill. Um, before that, you know, I wasn't that good with gun skill mechanically wise. Um, tried to like outsmart a lot of my opponents but now I can rely a bit on my gun skill uh, a tip for getting your gun skill up I'd say is play a lot of T-Hunt if you're on console and if you're on PC obviously you have a lot more uh, of software to be able to play and get your gun skills up like the aim trainers you can download but for console uh, I'd say just play a lot of T-Hunt and find a sensitivity that uh, is good for you. So, yeah. So, the next question is from R6Tats, and he asks, What games do you plan on playing in the future? Um, Rainbow right now is my main game, and it probably will be for a very long time, until either the game dies or uh, a new game that grabs my attention comes out. But... I'm looking forward to pretty much just what everyone else is really, you know, GTA 6, I want to play that. But I am saving up for PC, and I really want to try and get into CSGO alongside with Siege. And I also want to try games like Valorant, um, you know, the games that are getting quite big recently. So yeah, those are the games I'm planning on, and uh, I probably will be making content on them in the future. Next question is from Killer of the Killer, and he asks, uh, if you were smart enough to do any course at university, what course would you do? Um, I'm really interested in like physics and science, but I'm not uh, like big brain enough to actually study it. But when people talk about space and like matter and stuff, it's really interesting. Um, I did listen to this podcast about space and stuff, but it got a bit too technical for me to understand. But yeah, probably something along the lines of physics and science and stuff. Uh, and Shen asks, what person do you look up to the most? So I'd say for a siege, it would probably be Benjamin Master or Spoit. Uh, they're just, you know, really grinding siege and amazing players and they're they're definitely gonna go far i can already see that and everyone else can too but outside of siege uh i don't really know i'd say somebody like in the music industry um i respect a lot of the like young artists that are doing a lot for themselves you know um really like grinding and Putting out music, making a name for themselves. Probably people like uh, Lil Mosey and stuff. I really like those. Uh, the next question is by Burst OG, and he asks, uh, "What would you like to do in the future?" So right now, I'm in college and I'm doing uh, vehicle maintenance, uh, but like that's like mechanics stuff, and I find it interesting. You know, I find it quite easy in a good way and it's interesting too you know it's something that's an actual real life skill but i don't know man like right now obviously i'm doing the content creation just starting this up uh, i do like it and i want to go somewhere with it but obviously i'm i'm not going to be an idiot and purely focus on this because at a, such a small stage right now that'd be a stupid thing not to have a backup plan and stuff uh, this is just a hobby right now but I never know, it could turn into something more than that. But yeah, so, that's really about it. Uh, Pansy OG asks, If you had the choice to drop education to become a YouTuber at this age, would you take the opportunity? Uh, right now, with the scale of my content creation, absolutely not. 
uh, it's you know it's it's not going to make me any money. It's at nowhere near the uh, size I need to you know support me, even though I do enjoy doing it. But if I was somewhere at the skill of uh, Spoit or you know somebody like that Spoit, obviously Pengu and stuff at my age, uh, then of course yeah, because I would have the like. I could support myself from YouTube and also enjoy doing it as a job. So yeah, but right now, no. Uh, I have two questions from Akeem here. The first one is, what's your favorite operator slash operators? So for like defense, I'd probably say Legion. I think he's really, um, how do you say, versatile. Like, you know, he's got his impacts, he's got his Legion mines, he's got a really good gun. Um, and then on attack, I'm probably just gonna have to go with Ash because I play the best on Ash. But uh, yeah, that's probably my favorite operator slash operators. And the second one from Akeem is the best PS4 player I've played with. Um, it's hard. I've played with a lot of really good people, but I'd probably say someone like Pillis. Uh, he's really good. He's moved to PC. But other than that, I think Walkouts go. I play with him. He's my duo. He's really good. Uh, probably one of the best I've played with. But uh, yeah. But uh, that's it, guys. Um, I can't really do many more questions because uh, the editing software won't let me do much more uh, footage. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'm excited to bring you guys more content in the future. And I'm really happy to have joined Vivify. Um, my links will be in the description uh, to my Twitter and my YouTube. If you guys want to go over there and drop a follow and a sub just to be notified when I upload. And uh, yeah guys, stay safe and uh, much love to all of you.